What's up students? Welcome back to another Journal Thursday video. These last two weekends in middle school, we've been working through this series we've called Levita What? Where we're talking about the book of Leviticus. And some of you may have never read it, maybe you've never even heard of it, but for those of you who maybe are familiar with it, you might be asking questions like, why does this book matter in the Bible? Why do we learn about sacrificing bulls on altars and priests and what they do and all these weird questions. And so this last weekend, we focused really specifically about the role of priests and how Aaron was this high priest and what they did. And we saw that these priests, they kind of represented the, the people of God, the Israelites. They represented God's people to God when they brought sacrifices to him. And then also they took the word of God and they taught it to the people. And we asked this question, why does it matter? And it concluded with kind of two things, that we see that Jesus is the great high priest, and we see how he was the perfect fulfillment of what we see in Leviticus, and because of that we can uh, be made right with God, but then also how in 1 Peter 2.9, we are called, like you and me, are called a royal priesthood. And so in your, in your journals today, I want you to reflect on this question. What does it mean that we are a royal priesthood? Like, what does it mean for your life now, today, in 2021, to be a royal priesthood. After that, you're going to prepare your heart for this upcoming sermon. You're going to do three things. You're going to read, respond, and then remember. You're going to read James chapter 1, the very last paragraph, verses 26 through 27, two verses, and then you're going to respond. What do you learn about God? What do you learn about us? And at the very end of your journal, we want you to remember that God hears your prayers. And so spend your journal time finishing up by praying to God. I hope that you have found these uh, journals fruitful and encouraging for your uh, journey of living and loving like Jesus. We'll see you guys on Sunday.